Look, the only reason why I'm making this video is because someone needs a little bit of spreading, if you know what I mean. Carlton, Carlton Loth, Carlton Broth. Oh, fuck! Carlton Moth, Carlton Sloth. I don't really know which one it is. You see, I would have left you alone, Carlton. I really would have. But this one picture that you posted on Instagram about two days ago, it's a nice picture, don't get me wrong, but the caption is an absolute abomination to the fitness industry. I tell shit how the fuck it is. Your life and the universe as a whole. Let's take a look at what it says. Some people think they are alerting or teaching beginners and people who are just starting off what is and what isn't achievable naturally. But really, they are just degrading some top athletes who are living the lifestyle drug free. If you seriously think that you can't look good without drugs, then you're either stupid or just mad with how you look that anyone who looks better than you is automatically on everything under the sun. These sorts of people are actually what is wrong with the fitness industry. Don't just use your opinions and assumptions and think they are straight facts. Because when it's shit talking, you just look like a pussy. Many people agree with me here. And if you don't, I hope you live a long life hating. I came up with a term of endearment to refer to people like you. It's called puss boy. Do you know why you're a puss boy? Because you lie to a large group of people for self gain. Honestly, I think people feel bad for you because you're so deep in your own lie that you're actually beginning to believe yourself. In fact, you're the only one in on this joke because there's no one in the fucking world that thinks that you're natural. Now, I've been doing a lot of research recently and my conclusions are pretty sound. In order to achieve the veiny wiener physique or the VWP, one must eat like a veiny wiener competitor. Now, what does a veiny wiener competitor eat? On Carl's Instagram, he uses buzzwords such as cheat meals and, oh, it's so easy for me to stay shredded. In fact, I feel 10 times healthier and better when I have zero body fat. That's scary, considering the fact that your body needs fat in order to regulate its hormones, right? So the fact that you feel good at this low of body fat percentage tells me one thing. You are eating way, way too many trend bologna sandwiches, dude. In fact, it's just clouding your normal body functions to the point where you're like, oh, I feel good right now. You look like a fucking armadillo, my man. A hassleback potato. This is not healthy, and it's not healthy to promote to young men and women that aspire and look up to you. You mentioned in this Claiming Natural post that I should be 6 kilograms heavier in 18 months later, not 6 kilograms lighter. Explain it! I don't fucking know, you took a shit? It's not linear like that. You could be 90 pounds and be on steroids. You can be 400 pounds and be on steroids. That's the dumbest fucking excuse. By the way, I don't really have to do much work on this video considering the fact that people take one look at you and they know that you're lying straight through your teeth. The fitness industry has gotten to a point where they are extremely skeptical of who they trust and do not trust. In fact, now's the time for you to just be like, all right, I've taken steroids. And you know what people will do? They'll probably respect you and continue to follow you because your physique is insane. I mean, let's be real here. We know that that is never going to happen. And Carlton Loth is indeed a fake natural. And we also know that fake naturals are puss boys. It's the symmetric property of puss boys. So I figured let's just have some fun with this meme. Let's take a look at Carl's five year natural bodybuilding transformation. What am I looking at here? What workouts are you performing to achieve this body? I'm quite confused. I think this troll face is actually a call forward because he knows that he's going to be trolling everyone in the future by claiming natural. So throughout this video, Carlton doesn't put on any fat as he just gets bigger and stronger and more shredded. I think he has that David Lay gene going on, but what's funny is he also has that Uzoma Obolor lifting mentality, that bodybuilder physique in which he just lifts really slow, lightweight, high reps, slow. He fucks the weight. He fucks the weight. It's perfect for building muscle. A six plate deadlift. 
No other training footage of deadlifting. Wow, that's crazy, dude. This right here is a visual motif of his genitalia. Not only is it long, but he also wants us to know how wide it is. I mean, Carl is all about the girth. He is hung like a fucking tuna can, my guy. Alright, I can't watch any more of this cancer. Let's take a look at another video. In this video, he's working out with his younger brother. And mid-workout, he notices a small vein on his brother's latissimus dorsi. How much progression my little brother Max has made. Just like such a short time. He only turned 16 in the last year, guys. The fuck is that? I don't know, Carl. You tell us. What the fuck am I looking at here? W what is this? Are you okay? This is gross. Carlton, stop. Put that away. Carlton, put that away, dude. Oh my god, I'm gonna be sick. <laughs> Alright, what else does Carlton have on this social media shit? He's sponsored by Ect Apparel. Ect? What the fuck is Ect Apparel, dude? It sounds like someone throwing up. <laughs> Ect! Ect Clothing! Ect Apparel! Fuck! What a shit name for a company. CarltonLawFitness.com. Let's take a look at CarltonLawFitness.com. And we are here on CarltonLothFitness.com. Beautiful entry page. Click on the Start Today link to start today. Or not, because it's a broken link and your website developer doesn't know what the fuck they're doing. I sure hope our boy Carlton has his personal trainer certification. So here we have the Build Muscle Plan, and at the bottom of the page we have the Lean Down Plan. What you will receive, though, is a customized meal and workout program with videos accessible anywhere, anytime. Keyword accessible, not accessible. We're not trying to access these videos. We're just going to assess them. Let's try this start today link. Okay, it brings us to this page. And uh, for the small price of $100, so $33 a month, we're talking US dollars here. I already did the conversion. You will receive coaching from Carlton Loth. Fuck that shit. You puss boys aren't worthy of my Philion coin. Instead of flicking your little bean to all the money that you want to make in the fitness industry, why don't you reevaluate your strategy and just be a nice, down-to-earth guy that wants to help people and admit that you're using steroids or at least admit that you lied to the people. Don't stay down here with the puss boys. Go up top with John Skywalker, Vitaly. I mean, those guys are killing it. Is it ethical? Probably not. But at least you're not a puss boy. Listen, if the sport of bodybuilding is your thing, that's awesome, dude. I hope you go very far. But the common denominator in that sport is that everyone is on steroids. It's insulting to think that you can try to pass off the fact that you're natural competing against all these other guys that are working just as hard, have great genetics, and are using steroids, and that you're just some special snowflake. Get the fuck out of here, my guy. Remember at the beginning of this video when I couldn't decide what name to refer to you as? Carlton Moth? Carlton Broth? It's Carlton Sloth. This creature is just unbelievably adorable. Oh, goodness. Baby sloths make a really interesting noise. They do go I bet you'd fit in my pocket. I don't think they want me to put you in my pocket, but you would look really cute in my front shirt pocket. You like that? You like that idea? Get fucked. Hey, stuck in the bottom, got roots on my feet. Never been violent, but still kill a beat. Trapped in the jungle, I'm just trying to eat. The blood from my enemies stain on my teeth. Ride a motherfucker, die, ride up on my side. Give me the eyes and I rise like night, night. Almost had a minute to myself where I felt kind of peaceful. It went bye, bye.